Hello everybody, this is the Alolan Clasher, and today's video, we are starting a new series on the channel. As you guys can see, it's Pokemon Insurgents. I've seen so much about this game, and I'm really excited to come play it for you guys. Um, as you guys can see, it's a Nuzlocke, and here's how the Nuzlocke's going to work on the channel. So we're going to have, um, tr mostly traditional, it's like rules, here are the rules. Um, you can only catch one Pokemon per route or place you're in, and unless it is a shiny or a um, hidden grotto or like something where, like let's say like you go up to a Pokemon and like the Pokemon's actually a sprite in the overworld, you can catch those Pokemon too. Secondary rule is each Pokemon has two lives, and if it wants to die twice in battle or whatever. That Pokemon is sentenced to the box forever, but fear not. There are six revives. You can I can use six revives throughout the entire game, so I can go buy them whenever I want and revive as a Pokemon. And I'll give it an extra life. So if this Pokemon's already lost two lives and I need it, I can still revive it. And without further ado, and this amazing epic music, we are going to start the series. Welcome to Pokemon Surgeons. Uh, you guys don't need to see this. Uh, I'll play with Dark Story. And here comes the game. So we see some Pelipper and some Winkle flying around. Wow. This music's so good. I need a soundtrack for this. Sorry if I just killed your headphone users. I'm turning on the game just a little bit right now. So, these Pelipper fly in a certain direction, so let's see where we're going. I kinda stopped here. Where are we going? Flying inwards. Torin region, so that's the name of a region. Dot dot dot, one year ago. Okay, so keep that in mind, it's a year ago. Thank you all for coming. We live in dark times, my friends. A grave loss has recently befallen us all. The auger was a great man. Not only was he an unmatched trainer, but his heart burned with the desire to protect his people. He was our hero and possibly the best leader the Torn region has ever known. But... As you know, where other regions have evil teams or organizations, it's Pokemon worshipping cults that call the Torn region home. But to these cult religion is so much more than just believing. It won't last until the world is remade exactly how they want it to be. For our protection, the Augur defended them and disbanded over half of them. He saved us. A week ago he went searching for one of the remaining cults. He has not returned. He has not been seen since. People of Torin, I like you do not believe our Augur is dead. I assure you I will search tirelessly until he is found again. With a heavy heart, I accept the burden of taking his place until he is found. Until the first Augur returns, I shall be the second. I promise you, I will use every resource at my disposal to find him. We will stand our ground. We will not let these cultists, these insurgents, split our families and destroy the place we call home. Long live the Torn region! Crowd screams the same thing. Wow. We will remain strong. So, sorry about that Russian voice. I don't know what it came from. Um, so, as you guys can see, this game, I'm pretty sure, has this, the version of a Nuzlocke that you guys normally do i'm gonna say no and just let's play it because that way if, if we lose the nuzlocke then um we can just continue with the game and finish it out on the channel hello is this thing working can you hear me oh thank arceus you're not gone just yet you got to listen to me 
it will return any minute now. You need to stay focused and remember all you can. If you value your memories at all, you'll listen to what I have to say. We need to be quick. You at least remember your name, right? Um, we'll go with Alolan. Are you sure? Okay, okay, good. You remember your first name. What else do you remember? Are you a boy or a girl? I'm a boy. And do you remember what you look like? Now you guys can come find me in the streets. You know exactly what I look like. It's here, Alolan. You need to wake up. I sent someone to fend it off and get you out of here. You need to wake up! Whoa, those dark rides? Alright, the door is locked and Gengar is doing her thing. Soon, Dream Eater will rid the prisoner of the last of his memories. Hopefully, we'll be done within the hour. Well, how is our youngest prisoner faring? According to the computer, Miss Persephone, their memories should be completely gone very soon. Everything is going as planned. Excellent. Finally, we'll have fulfilled our end of the bargain. Good work, you two. We are starting the ritual soon in the upstairs room. Will you be attending? Of course, miss. I would never miss a sacrifice. Very well. I'll see you upstairs, then. Miss, wait, I have a question. After the child's memories are gone, what do you plan to do with them? Kill them, of course. I'll expect you upstairs within two minutes. Why are we bothering to wipe their memories if we're just gonna kill them? Anyways. No clue, but thanks for asking that in front of her. You know how she hates to be questioned. Let's go upstairs then. It's always fun to be a ritual being performed. This game's dark. That's what I like about it. It's better than a traditional Pokemon game, I guess. That's, that's what I heard online, so. Cat? Is there a cat? Where's the cat? That's oh, Mew. Scaring off that Gengar. Oh, the Gengar's gonna go tell her. We probably should get out of here soon. Okay, Gengar's gone. Go. Follow Mew out of here and never look back. Good luck. Okay. Um, let's get to work then. I'm gonna turn up the music a little bit. I don't know if you guys like that. And I will adjust my voice. Just to make it. Yeah. Um, a couple things. One, you answered the question today in the comments. And two, please tell me if you want, like, the music louder. You want the microphone louder. I just, I'm trying to play around with my new recording system. And want to see what you guys like. And what's not ear splitting. This will be a playlist on my channel. So yeah, I went and got the potion because why not? Can we go in here? Hmm. Ooh, another open door. Fingerprint scanner. Hmm. What do these books do? It's a book that reads the Cult of the Torum Region. Would you like to read it? The Torum Region has, as far as we know, always been under the threat of different legendary worshiping cults. There are five cults currently in power. The Cult of Darkrai, the Abyssal Cult, Infernal Cult, Sky Cult, and the group simply called Perfection. All of these cults are extremely dangerous and should be treated with extreme caution. Okay, my guess, and I'm going to take a quick little guess, is that this is the Darkrai Cult. Because they're wearing Darkrai suits. I'm going to take, probably, take no, I'm pr probably right about that guess. Five other cults? Are we going to have to see them all in the game and beat them all? This is scaring me. Let's go up the stairs. I got my workout for today, going up those stairs. Hey, Mew. Let's go up this, these stairs. Mew. He's holding a small note. I chose Mew to help you out of its mess to its, to its special ability. Its ability to use transform to change its form and disguise as something and something else. However, unlike Ditto, Mew can transform you as well. If you find DNA... You can dis disguise yourself as someone else. You should be able to use this to escape the base. Good luck, your benefactor. Who's my benefactor? Well, let's just go up here. I think that's blood. 
Yep. We got some dark right cultist DNA. So what do we do? You can transform. I'm a dark right cultist now. Can I keep that the whole game, please? I'll keep it the whole game. Uh, that, that's kind of cool. You just walk around being a cultist and scare Pokemon. It'd be kind of fun. Wait, so wait, can I go back and get the fingerprint scanners open now? Hold on. Let's go check. Let's go see if I can get the fingerprint scanners open. Yeah, there must be something important here. Oh, there's a potion. I mean, I'll take it. It helps us out in the nuzzle, right? Early stages. Let's go check out to see what else we got. I know there's one more. Right, right here, yeah. Nothing back here. I think that was the only room that was locked. Let me just go check real quick. Sorry, wasting your guys' time. I just want to make sure we have the right items for the Nuzlocke. You don't want to lose a Nuzlocke. Okay, it's the last door. Is that the one we all go open? This dark red cult has a lot of boxes. Ooh, or Pell. Yep, that's what it was. Okay, some good stuff. That'd be good for grinding, so we don't have to waste our encounters. So, you guys, um, if you ever need to refer back to the rules in this, the Nuzlocke, always come to episode zero, which is this episode I'm recording. And I'm assuming we, uh, my goal is to get to, st to get a starter in this episode. So, is there a way I can save? Yeah, so I'll just see. So it's been 10 minutes. Um, I don't have a different game file. I don't know what it's talking about. Okay. There we go. Guess we're ready to go now. Okay. Sorry, my keys weren't working for a second. Does WASD work? Okay, WASD is key items. I was just playing around with my keys. I'm using the... Okay, so now we can go through this door. So I'm assuming this is going to progress us. There's dark rice over there. There's items over here. Oh, I think there's someone blocking that. I'm going to have to go in there, though. This is really weird, like... They're like... Or cults, like... I can understand, like, bad guys, but cults? Yeah... This, maybe this is why it's called the Dark Story. Um, they said that we can... Wait, did, wait, hold on. Shift, make, shift makes you run faster. Oh. I need that. Yeah, I need to run fast. Okay, here. Here, I'll run faster, you guys. I don't like it, but... Hey guys, uh, I also do apologize if you guys can hear my typing in the background. I do not have the quietest keyboard. But this is all I can record this game on. And I know you guys would rather see this than not see it. I mean, I haven't had a video on my channel. But the thing is, though, I've had, I have three deck profiles right now ready to go. So I have, just so you guys know, in the future you guys will be seeing a um, Gardevoir GX deck profile. I might be going up before this. I don't know what the schedule is going to be yet. But you'll definitely see a Galeosopod, um, Galisopod Garb deck, um, also made by, um, Pokemon Master Kenny. So you guys will see that. That'll be, it's another deck profile coming up, and then hopefully we can get to something else. We don't know, I'm also working on some sort of a Tapu Koko deck. You might not see that one, because I'm, I'm still working on it. But let's get to the game. Let's see what we got. And so we begin. Miss, please, you can't do this. I don't want to die. You swore when you joined the that you would give your life for us. How is this any different? Activate the ritual circle. Darkrai, Lord of Darkness, I call upon you to enter our world. In return, I offer you 
to solve this loyal servant to be bound to your world of nightmares forever. Vocal Victorium Umbarium Dominium. Ooh, this is getting serious. Black serious stuff. I need a donut though. Please give me a donut. I want donuts, please. Those look like donuts. Give me some donuts. It actually looks like a cultist. Something's here. Looks triggered. It's triggered. It's triggered. Dark Rye, Lord of Nightmares. You are the great balancer of the world. You punish the great, slay the immortal. It's been a year since I saw you last. You remember what occurred then? We accomplished something incredible that day. I thought finally you'd accepted our offer to join us, but then you fled soon after, never to be seen again. Now I call upon you again. Dark Rye, why will you not join me? I know my sister has seen you time and time again. Why do you favor her over me? I beseech you, Dark Rye, join me. Come join the cult that has worshipped you for so long. With my guidance and your power, the work will be ours. Ooh, it just left her. Well, isn't that just lovely? It's probably gone off to, to Sling City to see my sister again. What a waste of a grunt. And what do you two want exactly? Miss, please, I'm confident that if we had another try, we could trap Dark right here. We don't know what it why what it did would it We don't know why it didn't work this time. But if you'll just give us another chance, get out of my way. Fire blast. Okay, she obliterated those two. I'm going to check in the printer's prisoner. None of you better come after me. Um Oh yeah, she doesn't see me, I'm secret. Hey guys, I'm the prisoner. Don't tell anyone. If you tell her I'll be dead. I don't want her to be dead. So don't tell her. I'll pay you. And fake Pokeyen. Oh yeah, you guys won't know it's fake, because I, I run a counterfeit Pokeyen business. And no one knows about my counterfeit Pokeyen business. Hey, you guys better not tell anyone about my counterfeit Pokeyen in business. And if you guys are joking. Just so you know, that is a joke, so don't take that too seriously. I've had people who've taken some jokes really seriously, like, that aren't even as bad as pokey and counterfeiting. I bet you there is something in This game's already dark. I've heard there's, like, a black market. So, I mean, there, there might be counterfeit down there. Shade Forest. Um, can I transform into a dark, dark gray cultist, please? I really want to be a dark gray cultist and just transform. Oh, there's no. I can't use it because there's no reason. What if I just want to be swag, dude? Here I go. Wee yeah, this game has really good music. So, um, the developers of this are probably some awesome people for making this game. And those of you guys who don't know, this game is not Sun and Moon included, so you won't see any Mimi cues, which really hurts my feelings. But I understand they can't they can't cater to all of us. Plus, this, I think this game was in being made before Mimi cue was made. So there's a small flute in another Noemi's hand. Obtain quartz flute. This flute lets you call upon Mew when needed. To use it, go in your bag and either use it directly or register it. Good luck, your benefactor. Ooh, who's this kid? I could swear I saw Mew here, just now. Did you see it? A tiny pink Pokemon? It was floating really close to you. I didn't see anything. Do you guys see anything? Must have been my imagination. Must have been my cotton candy I just downed. I could swear, I... My name's Damien. I'm an inspiring Pokemon trainer. And you are Alolan. Got it. You came to tell them time at the perfect time. The Augur, the greatest man in the world, of course, is coming today. You know who the Augur is, right? Uh, no, who is he? How could you not? Have you been living under a rock? He's the guy who protects the region. He's my biggest hero. The mayor and the townsfolk have been preparing ever since this morning. I'm excited. I was just running errands before he arrives. You know, I know. Why don't you help out? We're assigning jobs in the town hall. You know, cleaning and so on. So, I have to go help a kid I don't even know. Great. Kind of sounds... I'm assuming this is the town hall. It looks town hall-ish. I finished cleaning up the road. Is there anything else I can do? Oh, this is Alolan. I met them outside. It should be him, I think. 
They offered to help too. Nice to meet you, Lowen. Well, Damien, I think we're pretty well finished. As long as you have your gift for the auger ready, I think you're done. You do have your gift, right? Oh, well, um, I may have forgotten. Of course you have. You better find one, and fast. I heard you find a rare stone in one of the caves in the forest. Of course, you need a Pokemon to go safely. No, absolutely not. Not a chance. Damien is not ready to get a Pokemon. He's still just a child. Mom, please. Everyone else in the town already got theirs and have left. And you're not going to follow them. You'll get yourself killed. Why do you care? It's not like you're my real mother or anything. The shots. I've raised you since birth. You're not capable of raising a plant, let alone a Pokemon. Ooh, the roast. You're irresponsible, antisocial, and you can't even... That's enough out of you two. You're embarrassing us. And you said your name was a low one? I'm sure you've handled a Pokemon before. Nope. We'll lend one to you both and Damien. Will you be willing to help him through the forest and the cave to find, help him find the gift and the offer? Of course. Wonderful. I'm very grateful. So let's settle then. Alone will help Damien get a gift from the auger and Damien shows responsibility. Perhaps he can keep the Pokemon afterwards. Well, how does that sound? Fine. He won't, though. Alone, let's go. So I guess we're gonna go get a starter now. I'll meet you at the professor's lab to get an Eevee. An Eevee? Hey, Lulan, thanks for agreeing to do this with me. It really means a lot. An Eevee? That's the start of this game? Darn it, I don't like Eevee. Eevee's ugly. Sorry, Eeveeolution fans. I just, I don't, I like some Eeveeolutions. And I just don't, I don't know. Whee! This looks like a lab. It's gone. <laughs> oh, this guy looks like Giovanni. Listen, Professor, these Pokemon, they're freaks. No other trainer would want them, and we can't keep them any longer. All I want is for you to take them. You already keep a bunch of Eevee as it is. Surely these three won't be a bother. And why do you care about them? I know what you've done. It's true, I'm merciless. I've done some awful things. But there's no reason for these Pokemon to die. Um, hello? I'm Damien, this is Alolan, and we're here to get a Pokemon so we can go into the forest safely. S Sylvan? If you don't take this Pokemon, I'll release him, and they'll surely die in the world. If you want, I can just give them to these kids, right? Put them on the table. Very well. This guy looks pretty cool. Ooh, so we I think we have an option for three more starters now. Let's hope- Excuse me, please. This guy seems pretty chill. I mean, I don't think he's done anything. Let's see. So you're just gonna need a Pokemon. Yes, ma'am. I see. That man when he was just now, he was one of my colleagues in the university. He's a smart man and a great scientist. He's also the leader of the Cult of Perfection. A cult leader? Those people are evil, Professor. You should be talking to them, let alone be accepting gifts from them. Tell me, Damien Alolan, have you ever heard of something called Delta Species? No, what's Delta Species? Me neither. And allow me to explain. Delta Pokemon are based on the phenomenon in the Halon region far away. Pokemon that have a different DNA than normal Pokemon. Simply put, they're tied differently than normal. E example being an Electro-type Dragonite or a Water-type Porygon. These Pokemon on the table are Deltas. Ooh, Delta Pokemon. I'm gonna get one. I, I'm not sure what the type they are. They seem to experience a Bulbasaur, Charmander, or a Squirtle. They're scientific marvels, so I'd love to keep on a study. And normally I'll give you an Eevee as Pokemon to start off your journey. However, it seems that there are three more options for you to choose from. So I offer you this. You may choose one of the Ace 3 Delta Pokemon to travel with, or an Eevee I normally give away. If you want an Eevee, talk to me. Otherwise, take your pick. Alone, I don't know what to do. I don't like the idea of Pokemon made by a murderer. He's a murderer? But I don't like the idea of these Pokemon left alone in forever. You can pick... But hurry up, we don't want- we don't know when the auger is arriving. So let's look at the starters and we will end the episode there. This is the Ghost and Dragon type Pokemon Delta Charmer. Is this your pick? No. Delta Bulbasaur, I'm assuming? Nah, it looks fairy. Looks looks like dark and kind of fighting. So, guys, um, I guess I'm going to get to today's question of the day really quickly, um, because I was, I was assuming we we're going to get to pick the starter on the episode, and I was right. What starter will I choose? And you have, uh, the winner gets a shout-out, so it'll be me in the next video, and um, I don't know what starter I'm going to choose. Probably, it'll probably begin between the next two episodes, so um, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and... 
I guess for now, this is Yolo and Clasher signing out. And guys, thank you for watching. It really means a lot. If you guys want to see more of this series, just leave a like button. I want to try to break the like goal of 10 likes. Please, 10 likes. Can we do 10 likes? 10 likes? Okay. I'll see you guys in the next video. This is the Alolan Clasher, signing out.